you're saying right now? I'm saying goodbye to my old friends. <laughs> my nipple piercings. Hopefully the hole stays there so I can put it, just put it back in, but... Oh my goodness, guys. I thought I was gonna walk out like nothing, but... See it in the video. I know. Maybe I'll you ladies. It's a long tube, guys. I remember for Cassie, she like cut it and then... Te vas a desmayar oh. poquito. Yeah. Shout out to the fam. Look, you can't spell love without L V E. You can't spell love without L V E. You can't spell love without it. You can't spell love without it. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Before we get started with today's video, I want to tell you guys a thank you giveaway because you guys already know this giveaway in every single one of you. And today it is another Mark Jacobs bag. This time it is a black one. So I'll put a picture of it right here. Also with the last time winner right here. Thank you guys so much for all your entries. I love you guys so so much. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. By the title of this video, you guys know that I got surgery. But if you saw my last video, you knew that it was coming. I told you guys it was coming sooner than you guys thought. Um, so if you guys are seeing this video, that means I'm out. I I am healthy and my titties are brand new. I am so excited guys. You guys know that I've been wanting this for a very long time now and the time has finally come. So this video is going to be me packing for surgery, me going into surgery, me coming out of surgery and just me just showing you guys everything because you guys know I bring you guys along my whole entire life so why not bring you guys along my surgery and I'm super excited. I want to show you guys what I'm packing. Um, also guys, I got my hair done today. I know you guys are going to be like, why did you get your hair done? It's going to be in a bun. Well, the way my ganas be growing out, guys, because I'm so stressed I am at all times, because <laughs> I'm always so stressed. My ganas come out so, so fast. Is that why you come out? Or let me know, why do, you guys, why do you guys get ganas? Because my ganas, literally my wet hairs, come out so, so fast all the time. So I knew that I wasn't going to be able to get my hair done soon because I have, like, recovery and stuff like that. Well, depending how I come out, because I know I was watching videos last night, and it was very 50-50. Some girls came out like, hey, what's, up? what's the next surgery? And then some girls came out like, <gasps> Like, you know, so it depends on your body. Everybody's different. So hopefully I'm one of the girls who just come out like nothing, but we will see. So that's why I got my hair done. I didn't want to wait longer. So you know, my ganas would have been like up to here. So shout out to Jamie. Let's pack up our surgery. I'm going to show you guys what I'm taking with me. Also guys, keep in mind that everything is going to be different for others. Like for me, I'm going two hours away um, because Dr. Campos is in Tijuana and he's the only one I trust with my body. I know there's plenty of amazing doctors out there, but he has been the only one to touch my body. So I trust him with my whole entire life. So, also guys, I want to thank you for all your well wishes in my last video. If you guys did not watch it, I announced that I was getting surgery and I love you guys for wishing so many good things on me and I love you guys so, so much. So let's go see what I'm going to pack. Hey guys, quick interruption before we keep going with today's video. I want to quickly thank SeatGeek for sponsoring today's video. Oh my god, I cannot believe I'm even saying that. I have been using the Siki Gap for so long now. You guys know I love going to concerts, I love going to festivals. I just love having fun. And Siki has made the process of buying tickets for those events so much faster, so much easier. So please, guys, if you guys have any sports events, any festivals, any concerts that you guys are going to, please don't forget to use the Siki Gap and use my code LOVEFAMILY for $20 off your first Siki order. And if you guys do not have the Siki Gap, I'm gonna leave a link down below so you guys can go download it. Let me show you guys how easy it is to use. So right now, I'm on the app. I'm gonna leave a little screen recording right here so you guys can see what I'm looking at. But right now, it's such a bad bunny because, guys, I've been on TikTok. I'm on TikTok all the time. And my For You page is always about the bad bunny concert. I feel like ever since he went on tour, that's all my For You page has been. And it looks so lit, so fun. So I'm going. Let me know if you guys are going. I'm going to the SoFi one, I think, I believe. I don't know which I'm going to yet, but I clicked on it. So you click on it. I'm gonna show you guys right here on the screen. So you click on it, you click on bad bunny. You click, I'm going to click on the first one. One thing that I love about SeatGeek is they let you know if you're getting a good deal or a bad deal. So you see on the map, there's green dots and there's red dots. So the green dots means you're getting a good deal and the red dots mean you're getting a bad deal. So please, guys, if you guys have any events you're going to, please don't forget to use my code LOVEFAMILY for $20 off your first SeatGeek order. Let me know what events you guys are going to. Maybe we can mm, link up. Thank you once again, SeatGeek, for sponsoring today's video. I love you guys so, so much. And now let's get going with the video. All right guys, let me show you guys what I'm packing. I have my maletita right here. Obviously, it's not that big because it's not that much stuff. I am bringing a lot of extra stuff just in case though. Hopefully, like I told you guys earlier, I walk out like nothing and then I get to go home that same day. But uno nunca sabe, so we have to prepare for the worst. So this is my maletita from Laura's Boutique. I love the color green. You guys already know. Um, the first things first, obviously, obviously, siempre, siempre bring a toothbrush so bring a toothbrush just so you feel safe just in case they might have some there i don't know but nunca sabe. and then i also brought my makeup wipes because i get very very oily sometimes and i just love to a clean fresh look sometimes my deodorant porque sometimes i do be smelling so, so that is it for that bag 
And then next up is my skincare. You guys know I've been obsessed with skincare lately. So I'm taking this just in case. I can even put it on the morning. But I must have must haves always always are the um this one from Timmy is called the Vita C Serum. It always makes you feel just alive and awake and just so bright. And then also my eye cream, Abiguita, because you never know when you want your hair up. And then I also have some Vaseline because my lips get super, super dry at all times. So you don't want them to be dry. So I bought my Vaseline. And then also, I also brought some lip oil just in case. And then a hair clip because these little pelitos do be getting in my way and I want them out of my way. So next up is my Faja and this one's from Lori's Boutique. I love, love this Faja. It makes me feel so secure and I just love it. This one is a size small medium I believe but they go up to size 3X. They have the little um, bungee thing on the back so your butt lifts up but it's also very tight on the top so I love, love, love. Just to feel secure especially under dresses I love wearing this one but since I'm just going to be laying there why not be Fajada? Siempre en Fajada, nunca en fajada. Or how do you say that? <laughs> and then I also brought my fajita shorts, which I love. Um, I just love to be fajada at all times, guys. If I'm not fajada, it's because, um, I don't know, I'm never in fajada. So I don't know what I would be doing if I'm not fajada. <laughs> I also brought some socks, just in case. I do have my pantuflas downstairs, my slippers downstairs, because that's those are the ones I'm going to be taking over there. Because after surgery, it's really bad to bend over. So I always have my slippers, that way you just slip them on and you're good to go. I also have my calzoncitos because you never know, mm, I might short. I'm just kidding. No, I always have just have extra underwear. And then my these shorts, just to brought my t-shirts, I brought them in black. And then I also brought them in gray because I wear these too much. I wear these 24-7. I wear them in a size small, I believe. Yeah, these are a size small and I am obsessed with them. You guys know I wear them all the time. With my discount code, I believe they're $6. If not, I'll put the right price right here, but I'm pretty sure they're $6 with my code LAURASM for 40% off my best, my besties. I love potato shorts. This is very important when you're getting a boob job. I've got this on the sale section at Nordstrom Rack. It is a batita that has the buttons because when after your boob job, you cannot raise your hands too much. So I got this batita. That way you could just put it over and I also, they also, it also came with the matching shorts. And then I also brought a cobijita and this one's my baby's cobija. This one's Elliot's cobija and Oakley sleeps with it too. So maybe I could just sleep. If I end up staying over, I'll be very comfy. The wallet, of course, my ID. Cause you guys know, if you guys remember the last order, I forgot my ID, but that is basically it guys. So yeah, guys, let me know what else I should be packing. Actually, you can't tell me because I'll be already out of surgery. So that is what I'm going to be packing. Let me know what else you guys pack in your surgery bag. But yeah, guys, I think after this clip, you guys will see me waking up in the morning going to surgery because my mom, me and my mom are leaving tomorrow around 5 a.m. Hey, guys, I'll see you guys in the morning. Actually, guys, before I leave, I want to show you guys my before. I wish I could take the shirt off because this bra top literally makes my boob look so good. But without it, you'd be like, what the? What? I, you can never tell. This bra literally lifts your boobs so, so good. This is the bikini from Laura's Boutique. But I literally... <laughs> my baby. It literally lifts my boobs up so good. So right now, guys, they look... All right, but if I take my shirt off, they literally like, I don't know how they, it like flips in. I don't know how to explain it, but um, I also want them a little bit smaller. I wish I could show you guys without the shirt so you guys could see what I mean. But also guys, it's been almost 10 years. It's been almost nine years actually since I had my implant. So it's time to change them. So why not change them? And I am gonna be so happy. I'm gonna be so much more comfortable. I said, I told you guys I was going a little bit smaller, which this boob is bigger than this one. I don't know if <laughs> I don't know if it's just me, but one of my boobs is always my, one of my boobs has always been bigger than the other, and this one's bigger. So I think I'm gonna stick with this size. Do you guys see the difference? Hey okay, guys, I am so excited. And <laughs> what are you doing? Do you know your mama's in here? What are you doing? What are you doing, baby? You know your mommy's in here. What are you saying right now? I'm saying goodbye to my old friends. <laughs> Get away from me, baby. Let me say goodbye no. to each one of them. Lay down. <laughs> Don't film this. This is for only Oh my goodness, guys. Good morning. <laughs> I look like that. Oh my god. Good morning. We actually did not end up leaving last night. We actually left today at like 4.30 in the morning. But guys, we are here. We are almost there. We're actually like five minutes away. But my mom wanted some Starbucks. But yeah, guys, I'll let you guys know when we get there. I just wanted to update you guys let you guys know. We made it to Tijuana, basically. We're like at the border. My mom just wanted Starbucks. But yeah, guys, I'll let you guys... Well, actually, I'll show you guys my mom right now. She's addicted to her Starbucks. She cannot go a day without Starbucks. Aquí está mi mamá. No puedes ningún día sin su Starbucks. Ya casi la hacía, si no. Ah, Look at her. She always needs her Starbucks. Poquito. And que got us the oatmeal? I'm I can't eat anything right now. I'm so hungry. And then que got us oh, the oatmeal condiment. You know what I'm talking about? Ay, babosa. ¿Cuánto nos falta llegar? I wake up at 4:30, but now I'm at 4. ¿Cuánto nos falta llegar? Ah. Uh, 
Like five minutes. Like, yeah, five minutes from the border. We made it in. They just did the heart testing and everything came out perfectly fine. That's why it was coming in. Testing came back perfect. They put the little um thing on my wrist right here for the anesthesia and then for the calming medicine. Hey guys, I am ready to go. I'm about to change into my outfit. I have to take off my piercings, my nipple piercings. <laughs> Hopefully the hole stays there so I can put it just put it back in. But so you know, but I'll just do it again. <laughs> Officially all prepared, ready to go. I am a on la like something about the nausea medicine. They put like three things in me. I don't know. I'm fine. I'm chilling though. Now I'm gonna relax. Because when I got here, guys, I'm not gonna lie, I was very nervous. I was trying to hide it, but I was like kind of nervous, but I'm ready to go. We're like probably like what like maybe 30 minutes away from surgery. Alright guys, we chose the implant. I went with this one only because it's more natural looking. Um they have a lot of different <laughs> ones. Este es el que se mira más natural, ¿verdad? Sí, muy natural, yeah. se mueve en el pocket. Está este que es el de poliuretano, yeah. pero este es el, este queda bastante natural, queda muy bonito, sobre todo te va a dar una forma en gota muy yeah. padre. Yeah, so it's going to look the most natural, the best one, and the brand is Silly Meth, so if you guys want to get these, you should get these, but, ¿Cuánto falta para la cirugía? Uh, like in about half an hour. Ah! <laughs> they have their own little rooms back here, it's so nice, I'm about to get some anesthesia, y listos! I think after this, it's just anesthesia, and then from there, I literally wake up. I remember last time they put the anesthesia in me, and I literally remember just waking up. So hopefully it's like that this time, because I know some stories. I was literally on YouTube the other night, and I know some stories were like, I woke up during this stage, but that's never happened to me. I've never woken up. Um, but yeah, guys, hopefully I just wake up with new titty bitties. I love you guys, and I'll see you guys in a little bit. Oh my goodness, guys. I thought I was going to walk out like nothing, but I had to stay one night, because I was literally like... No pain or anything, but I was like sleepy. Like I was like, I don't know what the hell is happening. I feel like right now is the only time I feel awake, awake. Oh yeah. But oh my goodness. I, no, there's no pain though, nothing whatsoever. It's just my body just feels like. It's called anesthesia. Yeah, I think the anesthesia like it took a while to wear out, but I'm finally feeling better. Oh my goodness. My titties are brand new though, so what's up? I feel so, I think I still feel sleepy. I think they gave me pain medicine right now. Honestly guys, they take care of you so good here. I'm about to get some avena. I haven't ate anything since, not yesterday, the day before that at midnight. So, where's the maruchana? I. It just feels like a lot of pressure. It feels like someone's sitting on me. That's what it feels like. That's what it felt like last time. Oh yeah, baby. Just kidding. Vaya, <laughs> llévame a la casa, ya uno. Espérate, güey. I miss Oakley so much and Elliot. Pero no vas a poder cargar y no me lo vas a llevar. I think I FaceTimed them last night and I don't even remember FaceTiming face them, to be honest. Yeah, no, you don't remember? No, I, but I remember that I FaceTimed them. Te hubiera pejalado las greñas ahí. Why? Pues pa que, pa que despertara. Oh, no. Like, I remember it being on FaceTime with them, but I don't remember what I said, nothing. Oh my god. I have these things on my legs, guys, that like... It's like compression things, I think, for Pakizoma. So bad que no le tenga cuándo de sangre. Whatever she said, but they're so annoying. Ay. Los cuándulos de sangre se te ponen en cerebro y te dan un Okay. Te puedes morir. Por eso lo hacen. Okay, I'll see you guys in a little bit because I'm going to take a shower so I want to show you guys my shirt and everything. Look at my old implants, guys. He gave them to me so I could show you guys. They're so clean, so perfect. Look at... Nada les paso. These, have been in me. This ha these have been in me for nine years. I got new ones, but they look so, like, perfectly clean. So, like... <sighs> That's why I kind of got the same ones because I love the, f the feeling of my last one. So I was like, let me get the same ones because they felt so, like, natural and stuff. But, yeah. Oh my goodness, I cannot believe these were inside me for nine years. I'm taking them for memories. De los vendo, ma. 
te lo voy a robar, déjame pongo uno así. Échale. Voy a poner una. A ver cómo me veo. Chichis de lado. Ma, tú ya tienes chichis, mi mamá. Pero de chichis. Mi mamá has a huge chichis, I don't know. No, no tanto. Yes, you do. A ver, párate, no párate y volteate de lado. Imagínate así, I took a shower, guys, and I feel so much better. I still feel very drowsy. I think it's some medicine, though. I still have my I me and me. I changed my bra. Um, but they look so nice. I cannot wait to, for them to, like, like, fully heal, you know? But it's already, they look so, so nice. And I'm wearing... I did my skincare because I told you guys earlier I had to put skincare on. My face was so, so dry. My lips were dry. Yeah, we're ready to go. We're just waiting for a compost to come and... Check me and let me go. The only thing I don't like is the drain, guys. I have a drain. That's that's for all the blood and liquid to get out of me. Guys, yes, I feel so drowsy right now. I'll go to sleep. I didn't sleep at all last night because I slept all day. Maybe I'll grab you, ladies. My boobs, guys, right now? Oh yeah, baby. Oh, yeah. I cannot wait to show you guys. And these are those little manchitas, like from like the blood. But I, I feel perfectly fine. We're gonna leave right now. He told me that I need to stay till tomorrow, and I said, "These babies, I cannot stay." So he's like, "It's fine. Okay, you can stay." I mean, you can go. So we're leaving. I feel amazing. I cannot wait to see my babies. Lena, guys, it's kind of long, but we got a medical pass. Gracias a Dios, a mi mamá. So we're flying through the line. Look hey. at empty. Empty on the side. Look at the line. Oh, but you could have never gone near that or something. Oh, it's a thing. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, Chicken. Oh, my God. 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 Oh, my una canción para la tóxica. Ay, a ver, ay, cántale, ay. cántale una. La de, la de, la de, la de gracias. Le voy a, sí. le voy a cantar, sí. eh. Dile al niño. No, dele. Y gracias por aquellos que han hablado mal de mí. Y gracias por aquellos que preguntan más por mí. Que si vacaciono en París, que cuánto pesa mi feliz. Que si en mi casa soy feliz, que si el anillo es de ororis. Que les importa usted que aporta. Ya ve, yeah. para los tóxicos y para las tóxicas. Claro. Sí. Una cadenita. ¡Au! Ya no puedo, güey. Traigo las manos. Se bien, pegó, ¿qué? ¿Por qué? Ven para allá. Ven para allá. Ok, yo voy para allá. Oh. Mi mamá le regaló su cadenita. Luego no, me compro una de Navidad, ¿eh? ¿Cuánto, cuánto cuestan? ¿Como no, 100 dólares? Más o menos. Pero no te la vais a quitar nunca, ¿no? No, okay. no la voy a quitar. La chingada, pues. Amiga. No puede. No puede. Es no que te la quiero hacer Marta. chiquita. No puedo, Marta. No, <ríe> Laura, pendejo. Ah, Laura. No te la vais a quitar, ¿ok? Porque... A ver, a ver, a ver. A ver, Emilio. Uh. Ah. Cuidado, porque se pegó. Ah. We're still in line, guys, and I got some namagoneda. This was only $2.50. This big one was only $2.50, and it tastes so good. A la dieta. Mi mamá. ¿Cómo se llama ese anime? ¿Cómo se llama ese anime? Garafa, garafa. Carrapa. Carrapa. Something like that, but it tastes so, so good. Mm. Hello, I'm home. Hi, puppy. Hey, mama. Hey, mama. Hey, mama. Hey, mama. Hey, mama. Where's that one? Look at that one. Hey, Hi, Elliot. Hey. Not these guys playing catch with my silicone. Oh. <laughs> My dad's so grossed out. <laughs> Can you guys stop? It is day two, I think. Yeah, day two. And I feel perfectly fine. I just feel like I got run over by a bus in the mornings. You know how you wake up, you're like, oh. 
Oh, my back just feels like I just need to walk around. I hate, I am not the person to like lay down, guys. I'm always walking around, I'm always just doing my thing. So I forgot how recovery works. I forgot that you have to sit down. So my mom was like, sit down, but we're doing fine. We're perfectly, I'm gonna take a shower right now because I have to change my bra. They gave me two bras because I have to change them often. And I have to put this iodine, iodine because they don't want the cuts to get infected. I got your bra. Oh, thank you, baby. <laughs> Look how cute Gumpus is. He gave me and my mom a necklace. He's like, I appreciate you guys so much. Look how cute this is. A little necklace with his little logo. That is so cute and so thoughtful. Guys, I feel so much better after my shower. I showered, I did my skincare, me lavé la colita. It just feels so much better when you take a shower. I was able to do it all by myself. Yesterday, my mom had to help me a little bit, but today, todo lo hice yo. So, this recovery is going to be a walk in the park, I think. I think I just woke up very, like, oh, because my back, the, the tanto, like, from being in the bed for so long, I think. That's why my, my back was just like hurting, but right now, I feel so, so good. I need some coffee though. The only thing that I will tell you guys is I haven't gone to the bathroom in like two days now. So I think it's the medicine. I have all my medicine right here. And I love that Gumpels, he literally writes everything right here for you. Look, like he says, this is for this. Every little medicine has the instructions. Cause me, I would have forgot everything. Good morning guys. Today is day three or four. I don't know, my Sunday was on Thursday and today's Sunday, so three or four. But I feel amazing. I feel so, so good. It's getting better, better by the day. It just still feels like someone's like literally sitting on me, which is what I felt the first time I got it. Um, This night's a lot different cause I have cuts. So I got a B um, BBL. <laughs> yes, I did. I got a um, boob lift, so I have, um, the cut right here and then right here so it's kind of a lot harder i do still have the drains in me because i want as much fluid to get out of me but yeah, guys other than that i feel amazing i feel out of sea and i've been able to do everything by myself i showered yesterday i'm gonna shower again today um i'm gonna put the eye student thing that way the i don't get um what is it infections in my cuts all right guys i'm out of the shower each day gets better and better I, right now i just put some iodine on the um stitch parts that way it doesn't get infected sorry oakley's right here but i am Ready to go? Just for my bra on. I cannot believe how much smaller they feel, guys. They feel so much smaller. I don't know if it's because, and I didn't go that much smaller in implant size. So I had a 375, I think, and I got a 355. It's not that much smaller, but I think they just feel smaller because I don't have that much extra skin, maybe. I don't know, but they look so good. I cannot wait for Rick to see them. I think he is going to love them. If not, then what's up, baby? I'm single. Just kidding. La doctora Laura me está quitando los tubes. She took them off for Cassie, actually. It's a long tube, guys. I remember for Cassie, she, like, cut it and then... It's doctora, cocinera. Mama, stripper, grandma, puta, <laughs> de todo, güey. ¿Ya se quitó? Ya te lo quité uno. Ya te quité un, un, un de este. Un stitch? Un They're stitch. like stitched to your body, ¿no? Mm -hmm. Como? It hasn't hurt at all, guys. It just feels like someone's like tickling you. Because the stitches are literally like, you have to cut them off of that. Mm -hmm. But the stick... It's like this long. Está pegado por eso. Como está pegado poquito, me tengo que agachar poquito. A ver, me hacen hacer todo esto. ¿Se siente nada? No se siente nada. Nada, nada, nada. Oh, yes, you do. No se siente nada. No es nada, Laurita. Te vas a, oh. vas a quedar bien bonita. Te vas a desmayar oh. poquito. Ya. Yeah. What? Oh, gross. Bro. Oh my god, that feels so weird. I know. It's it felt simple. like the stick was coming off. Estaba hasta acá arriba. Oh, you Look at how clean it is. Look at how nice. Yeah, it's very clean. Okay. You good, mama. You good. Oh yeah, my god, that mejor. feels yeah, so weird. Mejor. Update, guys. I have no drains in right now, which honestly feels amazing. Honestly, they didn't bug me that much because for my BBL, I literally had them connected to my um, P-U-S-S-Y down there, and it felt so weird. It was just so uncomfortable, and it would pull it sometimes, and it would hurt so bad right now. Um, for the boob ones, it honestly did not feel uncomfortable. It just felt like I had, like, ansias. How do you say it in English? Ansias, like, I just wanted to rip it off, so my mom took it off. It literally was a pole, a pole, like, a stick, like, this long. If I have a picture, I'll put it right here, but it literally came from all the way over here, and it felt like...
like my implant was gonna come out, but it felt so relieving, so good to take them off. All right, guys, it's nighttime, and I'm about. <laughs> it's nighttime, and I'm about to take a shower. But the next video will be me showing Victor and all that good stuff, and then keep going with my um, recovery because I feel like. I could be good now, but then out of nowhere I can go bad because I did I did see a lot of videos. I feel like when I just got when I got surgery the first time, because I didn't research anything. Like I did research, but I didn't research. I think I just got lucky with the doctor that I went to, honestly, because I honestly did not do the research that I should have done. But now I literally looked online and I saw everything, every possibility, and um, it can go south in any time. So hopefully everything goes good. I'll keep updating you guys. But yeah, guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video of me getting surgery in Mexico. Let me know if you guys have any questions. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah. Let me know if you guys have any questions down below in the comments. That way I can answer them in the next video. But guys, I love you guys so much. Thank you guys for supporting me and everything that I do. You guys are literally the sweetest ever. I love you guys and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!